Look at where we are. You know, we're at the edge of the known world, as it was, you know, before we found out that it was round. We used to think that if you stood at the edge of the Dingle Peninsula and you looked west and you walked out there, you would fall off. Artists sense something when they come here. Of that, I have no doubt. There's something in the effort of getting here that makes the way that they perform different. It's our musicians and our artists who are the prophets of today. Because a prophet, biblically speaking, isn't a fortune teller. A prophet is somebody who tells it how it is, who can hopefully see things the way God sees things, so tell you how things really are, as opposed to the way that people might think they are. This girl came along and a man with her, and I was actually looking out for more people. I thought there was more people to come, and I just said to her, I said, where's your mother? And she says, my mother's back in London. And we were laughing in between her. I thought she, I thought she was a child of, of Amy Winehouse, to tell you the truth. Sometimes I think the people, when they go on the stage in the church, are a little bit sort of wary of it. If you're Snow Patrol and you play to 40,000 people last night and you play to 80 people tonight, you know, you're smack up against it. You're, you're, you're sitting in the lap of the person in the front row. So it, this is we different. Are delighted it is a different experience. Like Amy Whitehouse. We only say goodbye with words. I died a hundred times. You go back to her, and I go back to her. I go back to black. She touched all of us that year because she was just so, she was so un what she had been represented as in the tabloids. And there was no, we didn't care about any of that. We weren't interested in any of that and still aren't. It was just brilliant that she came with her spindly little legs and her mental hair and sang her heart out in Kerry for us. Brilliant, absolutely brilliant. I go back to 